His voice may sound like he's a professional singer, but the uniform gives him away. He's a contestant in the military version of American Idol. Service members come from all over the world to Northern Virginia to compete. Thousands of people hope to make it, but only a few made the cut. Fox Size Beth Parker introduces you to the best of the best. These boots were made for marching and maybe a little dancing, too. Cy Powell is stationed at Fort Bragg with the 101st Chemical Company. I'm uh, smoke and decon. I uh, do cover and concealment and decontamination for any type of chemicals or biological agents that come through on a, on a war zone. As you heard, he also sings. Powell is one of the participants in an army contest called Operation Rising Star. Making it is what these contestants are trying to do. They were selected from U.S. military bases all over the world and flown to Fort Belvoir for their moment in the spotlight. Well, this is great. It's just an awesome experience. I've met wonderful people. Everyone here is so great. I've had such a ball. And um, just to do what you love is awesome. Star Exum is a 20-year-old from Brooklyn. Singing is from within to me. Like, it's just a natural thing. It's not a hobby to me. It's a part of my life. She says it's a contest, but they've all become such a cohesive unit, you wouldn't always know it. We actually forgot it was a competition until judges started saying, you're out, you're out. One of those judges is Nigel Caro. He was a producer of American Idol, and he's impressed. They all really stepped it up. These contestants have tough day jobs. Some come from war zones. For some, it's an escape. It's a great, you know, a great machine that allows people to find what they're good at, and there's an outlet for it. Now they've narrowed the field to six finalists. The winner gets a recording contract. Oh, my goodness. I would go crazy. I would just be like, my name is Star. And she may be living up to her name. Contest airs on military TV and websites, and somebody may be marching all the way to Hollywood. In Virginia, Beth Parker, Fox 5 News. Pretty good. If you want to hear all the performances, visit myvoxdc.com. Click on today's links under Scene on TV, and you can vote to choose a winner. The Army is also looking for people to sit in the studio audience for tomorrow afternoon's final show. You can also get details on that on our website.